welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna do something different. I'm usually showing you guys these luxury mansions, but we're gonna take it a step lower today and we're gonna show you what it's like to be a single person or a single couple living in a luxurious loft or a one bedroom condo. Now we are here at Nat Riwat Jaranakan and it's a great location guys in the Jaranakan area. So I'm gonna take you guys on a little demo tour of what they have here. But first, let's go have a look at the demo. Come on, let's go. So here you can see it's a 29 floor condo in such an outstanding area. Now, I myself have been single. I also have been in a single couple relationship where I had no kids. So this is really suited for that kind of person. And let's not forget, you also have the view of the lovely Jiao Praya River. What more could you ask for? A great view, a single life. If you're a single person, or a single couple. Let's go have a look. Nat Riwa Charinakan is a 29 floor condo development project on Charinakan Road. Located near the CBD and the highlight of this project, you will get to see the view of the sunset and the exclusive view of the Chao Paya River. And here, they only have 253 units. Let's start by looking at the condominium model here first. A nice layout of the building with fully functional facilities. On the first floor, they have the garden, lobby and co-working space together with the mailroom and a herb garden. On the seventh floor, they have the kids club, fitness, playground and the multi-purpose area. Together on the 29th floor, they have the swimming pool and the kids pool. On this floor, you will see the Sky River view, the sunset view along the river with the infinity edge pool, which is the highlight of this floor. Starting off the tour here with the one bedroom loft at 39 square meters, only going for 4.99 million baht. It's a pretty good deal, guys. All right, so anyway, we are here in the kitchen. Like I said, I have been single. I've also been a single couple without a baby. And if this was something that I could have laid my eyes on when I was in that situation, I would have been really happy, especially with that great view that you get. So you walk in here and you're coming in to the tiny kitchen, but very modern and a homely feel here. You come in and on your left side, you've got a shoe closet. You've got plenty of storage space. I'm gonna remind you guys as well that this unit is the demo unit. So this is what they've done with the unit. But you know what? The good thing about watching all these videos is that you can create your own idea on how you want to lay this out. So here, they've actually maximized the space and they're showing you how you can maximize a slightly smaller space here. Plenty of storage units here. You've got a shoe cabinet. You've got a nice little seat here to put your shoes on and off because you know, when you get a little bit older, you need a little bit of help to sit down and put on your shoes. So we've got that here, you come in, you've got the kitchen, you've got a place to put your fridge, uh, you've got a washing machine. I'm sure these are washing machine dryers that you can also buy, so you can do two in one. You've got a stove here. This also reminds me of a very loft kind of city life, where you don't have that much space, but you maximize the space that you have. Plenty of storage here for plates and spoons and cups, whatever you want. Plenty of ventilation here. A nice place to put your microwave, oven, whatever it is that you use. Coming in here with a huge ceiling, all right, which makes it look even bigger. Standing at 4.4 meters. So you can see in here, you've got a nice high ceiling, which creates that loft vibe. Most lofts have really high ceilings because they're duplexes, and it just kind of gives it a bit of that New York City lifestyle. Here they have placed the sofa with their TV here. You know, I love my TV. So TV has to be like the centerpiece of the room, which they have done really well here with the high ceiling. They've actually kind of textured the ceiling. Now, the good thing about what they've done is that they've created a lot of textured interior, which I think creates a very homely vibe in a lot of these condos. Textured wallpaper, marble lining, gold lining, they put in the TV here. Again, they've also put in the TV also to give it more of a spacious kind of feel. So this would be your living room center area in the loft, all right? Plenty of space here and coming into a small little dining area here for two people. Like I said, this is great for a single person or even date night or even if you were a single person and you invited your date over. I think this would be quite nice and you have a nice view as well and a high ceiling, plenty of windows, 
Uh, great storage here again. They've created a lot of storage here with the space. They've also put in a small little closet here. Like I said, maximize the space that you had in small spaces. And I think they've achieved that really well here. Coming in to the bathroom, which is the main bathroom in this loft. Usually you would expect a slightly smaller bathroom, but as you can see here, this one has a lot of space. It's actually bigger than what I'm used to seeing in smaller lofts here. Plenty of space to create storage and a nice open shower. And it doesn't feel so compact, which is great. It's white and it's clean. And yeah, this is all you basically need. Now I'm gonna take you up to the second floor. Coming up onto the second floor, we are now entering the bedroom of the loft. Open, great airflow. I love that you can actually see down to the living room TV area, which also makes it that you can actually go and look at the nicer view from your bedroom. So you're getting the view from basically every point of this loft. Again, maximizing space. There's a plenty of storage space here and you've got a nice closet here. So I think how they laid this loft out was actually at its best potential for the square meters that you have. You've got a nice bed here, and I love the interior. Again, textured wallpaper with wood. You have your air con there, and you've got that high ceiling, so you've got great, great airflow. It feels open, it feels nice, and it feels very modern city life as well. And now we're gonna come and tour the one floor, one bedroom room here. And this one is going at almost 34 square meters and selling for 3.99 million baht. All right, come, let's have a look. So this one is a one floor, one bedroom, and it has the same almost layout with the kitchen here, which you've already seen, very straightforward, quite spacious. They even have a shoe cabinet here, except they didn't have a nice seating area here, which is fine, uh, but you still have the storage here. You've got a bookshelf. I like what they did with that. Actually, maximizing the walls as well is really good, which I haven't really thought about, but putting shelves on the wall actually maximizes the storage space as well. You come in and then you have the living room here. They put the seating area here, which is nice. It's cozy. You've got a mirror here. And may I say that putting mirrors on the walls actually opens up the space. It makes it look a lot bigger. So I'm a huge fan of putting mirrors on the wall here. And I don't know about you guys, but I always need a mirror to look at myself before I go out. So that's also a plus point. So we sit here, you could be having your date here, you could have your friends here, and then you come into the living room where you have the TV sofa area, and you've got a balcony out here with the great view again. So the good and the main thing about this condo is the view that it provides as well with that modern living city life space. And here you come in to the bedroom. Now the difference between the loft room and this one is that the main bathroom connects to the master, which is really good as well. Um, I know that I prefer a lot of my toilets connected to the master. So you come in here, you're gonna have a nice view here by your bed. All you gotta do is look out and see the nice view. You come in here, you've got closet space here, and you've got a nice desk and a vanity area here. Like I said, you could do whatever you want with the space. This is the demo unit. And coming into the spacious bathroom here. Again, I'm gonna emphasize the space in the bathroom. It's not small, it's not compact. It's actually laid out really well with really nice, basic, straightforward, materials that they've used here. You've got a nice shower as well. You've got a rain shower. It's very modern and again, spacious and open. And this is Nat Riva Jarena Khan. I have to say that this is located in one of the best areas in the heart of Jarena Khan, which is also located near Avani Riverside Plaza, Avani plus Riverside Bangkok Hotel, BTS Krung Thonburi, Samitabit Thonburi Hospital, and Icon Siam. All right, guys, we have come to the end of the EP. I would just like to thank Nat Rewat Jarena Khan for having me today. I had a lot of fun. These condos are suited very well for single people or single couples, very well designed with a fantastic view and area. So anyone that's interested, I will leave all the contacts on the link below. And uh, thanks, Milan, for my lovely dress. And um, yeah, bye, guys. See you guys later. Bye of a lovely river, and I forgot the name of the river. <laughs>
Jopaya River. Okay. You do have a small balcony as well coming out here. Sorry, let's try that again. <laughs> Prammy as well. And now we're going upstairs. Hold on. 